For those of us living far outside the tropics, coral reefs are an exotic underwater world that you only really encounter on a vacation or maybe in the occasional Disney movie. But coral reefs are much more than just a pretty face. For people in tropical countries like Kiribati, where I do field work, coral reefs are really one of the foundations of society. They provide food, they provide income, and they protect the shoreline. These valuable ecosystems are also the canary in our climatic coal mine. They are more sensitive to climate change than almost any other ecosystem on the planet. You see, corals, the animals that actually build the reef, get most of their energy from these colorful microscopic algae that live in the coral's tissue. This arrangement, however, is very sensitive to the water temperature. When the water gets too hot, the corals expel the colorful algae and literally turn white. If the hot water persists, the corals can basically starve to death. These episodes of what people like to call coral bleaching have happened in every part of the tropics during the past 30 years. And we expect them to become more common as the climate continues to warm. Climate change threatens not just the long-term survival of the coral reefs, but the livelihoods of the millions of people across the tropics that depend on coral reefs for food, for income, and for protection from rising seas.